The Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Physical Planning, Natural Resources and Cooperatives, in collaboration with the Taiwan Technical Mission in St. Lucia, through the Seven Crops Project, have established three weather stations in the communities of Babono, Denry and Schwazel. The data being provided by the weather stations will assist farmers in making more informed decisions on the cultivation of their crops and minimize loss due to changing conditions. Parliamentary representative of Schwazel Saltibus, Honorable Bradley Felix, highlighted the importance of procuring modernized equipment to ensure the sustainability of the agriculture industry in St. Lucia. I'm hoping that we take advantage of the predictions and the readings from the weather station so that we could make very sound decisions. And not because your neighbor is planting put, um, tomatoes or potatoes that you decide to do the same thing. That we can vary what we grow, okay? And we can do it with the knowledge and the science behind it. So I'm looking forward to a significant um, increase in production, in, in, in the quality, based on the readings that we will be getting from the the, the weather station and I want to take the opportunity to thank the government and the people of Taiwan for continuous con, for their continuous assistance. Ambassador of the Republic of China Taiwan to St. Lucia, His Excellency Peter Chen, reaffirms his government's commitment to assist in ensuring a more resilient agricultural sector in St. Lucia. The weather station before us is able to collect all sorts of data, rainfall, light intensity, wind speed, and humidity is solar powered and can be remotely accessed by the internet. This is what new agriculture looks like. I have full confidence that these weather stations are one of the important steps to achieving agriculture 4.0. We are honored to work with St. Lucia, a strong ally, and with support from my partner like the United States, on mutually beneficial goals with such meaningful impact. The Ministry of Agriculture, Fisheries, Physical Planning, Natural Resources and Cooperatives encourages farmers to take full advantage of the new technology received when planning their production cycles. From the Information Unit of the Department of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.